Let's reverse engineer your six figure business. Yes, today I'm going to break down exactly how you get to the elusive six figures in your service based business. My name is Ryan Downey and I'm a sales coach. I help brand new entrepreneurs build six figure businesses by mastering your sales conversation and your mindset. And today you are in for a treat because we are going to reverse engineer the six figure business. If you haven't watched my video on why six figures, definitely make sure you go check that out now. But six figure business, $8,333 a month equates to $100,000 a year. And it is this mythical thing that we talk about in the online space but how do you get there? So I like to work backwards, right? So if I know the number is $8,333, where do I have to start? So the first thing I like to do is figure out how many clients do you need to hit that number? So if you sell a service that's $1,000 a month, you need nine clients, right? If you sell a service that's $500 a month, you need 18 clients. So really making sure you know how many clients you need is the first place we have to start, right? And if you discover that the number of clients that you need to hit $8,333 in a month is way too many, then we probably need to have a conversation about your pricing and increasing those prices. So I'm going to go with very basic numbers because that's what I am good at. So we'll start with needing nine clients, which essentially will get us to $9,000. So now we know we need nine clients each paying us $1,000. So now we need to go to work on creating a $1,000 a month offer, right? So what is an offer? Offer is essentially what you sell. It's what people pay you for. And it could be anything from your social media management services to your digital marketing services, Pinterest management services, maybe you're a health coach, a life coach, there's a million different things that you could do to get there, but really thinking through what would I need to put in a package or a program that someone would pay me a thousand dollars a month. I like to think through when I talk about pricing is really valuing what you do based on result, not time. Right? So I don't want you going to work on just reverse engineering how much you should make in an hour, but how, what is the result that someone needs to get to pay me a thousand dollars? So in the business to business space, I want you thinking through if somebody paid me a thousand dollars, how much money do they stand to make with the service that I'm providing for them in the business to consumer space to so say you are a health coach or a life coach or something along those lines. Um, you know, what's worth a thousand dollars to that person and reverse engineer your offer in that way. Right? So we've decided we need nine clients. Now we have reverse engineered. We need a thousand dollar a month offer that we need to go sell to nine people, but we need to make sure that that offer delivers a return on investment. So write it down on the top of a piece of paper, $1,000. What can I include in my offer that makes it worth $1,000? And remember, it's not always your time. We don't want to trade time for money and we'll do the different video on that, but we really want to deliver $1,000 worth of results for someone. Okay, so now we know that we need nine clients and $1,000. We've got a $1,000 offer. Now we've got to go find some clients, right? That's how we get to $100,000. So for me, again, knowing that we need nine clients, now we need to reverse engineer how many people do we need to talk to to get nine clients. So if you're brand new and you've never run a sales conversation before, you're probably going to have a lower close rate than someone who has run a lot of sales calls and knows how to close and knows how to run them really confidently. So for me, I like to think for every five sales calls that you book or that you have that you're going to get one or two clients. For the sake of this, we're going to say two clients that puts you at around a bad at math, but what a 40% close rate, right? So if you run five sales calls and you get two clients out of that, that is around a 40% close rate. So now that you know, for every five sales calls I run, I get two clients. Bad at math again, remember we're gonna have to run what about 25 to 30 sales calls to be able to get the number of clients that we need. So for again, round numbers, we need 25 sales calls to get nine clients. Round numbers, making them up. Everybody's numbers are going to be different, but this is just me helping you really break down the math and reverse engineer what you're trying to accomplish. So now you know I need to book 25 sales calls. How many new people do I need to talk to to get to 25 sales calls? And this is going to be different for all of you, but I really want you thinking through okay, how many conversations, how many networking calls, how many um, emails do I have to send? How many, uh, how much networking do I need to do to book those calls? And this is going to be different for all of you, depending upon how many people are currently in your network, how many people you've actually been talking to so far, but we want to reverse engineer those numbers and know, okay, to get to those nine clients, I need to get 25 sales calls on my calendar and then go to work on that. And then take it one step further, work it back. Now we know we need to network at least an hour every single day. And hopefully, um, um, over the course of a week, if we're networking for five hours, um, we can book five sales calls, right? So say for every hour you put in, you book one sales call. So now we know 
Every week I'm gonna book five sales calls. If I book five sales calls, I'm gonna get two clients and I need to book 25 sales calls. So now we just figured out to get to my six figure business, potentially I need to close two clients at a time or two clients every week essentially I could get there in five weeks, right? Bad at math, but around five weeks. However, we also need to reverse engineer the amount of time it's going to take to do the client work. So if you can only onboard two or three clients at a time based upon your time commitments, then it's not just going to take five weeks. It's going to take even longer. And that's okay. There's nothing wrong with that. Nobody's building six figure businesses overnight. I just really like to break it down because down at the brass tacks of it, building a business is about numbers. It's about understanding what those numbers are and the transaction. Again, number of people talk to to sales calls booked, from sales calls to number of clients, from number of clients to dollars made, right? Super simple, but breaking down this math, mapping out your plan, putting this on your calendar can take away so much of the drama in your brain about how did you get to six figures? How do you even do that? You have a plan. Now, what do we need to do is make sure that we work the plan every single day and that we set ourselves up for success and onboard those clients in a timely fashion. So we all know, um, maybe you can, but most people can't onboard nine clients over the course of six weeks. So maybe you close two clients and then you wait a couple weeks, you close two more clients, you wait a couple more, but really making sure that you think this through is the key to success. And that is why I wanted to walk you through reverse engineering six figures. So again, we started $100,000, $8,333 a month selling a service. And again, I used $1,000 as an arbitrary number coming up with an offer that feels fantastic at $1,000 a month, reverse engineering our way backwards to getting to that $8,333 a month. Now, what do we do with that? Now that we have one $8,333,000 month, how do we continue to grow that? For me, I am a huge fan of recurring revenue. If I am you, I am not selling one thing at $1,000 a month. I'm selling $1,000 a month for six months, right? A retainer, a program, a package of some kind that creates recurring revenue in your business. I don't want you having to go out and close nine clients every single month to get to your goal of $8,333. So think through again, that package, that program that's worth $1,000 a month that somebody would sign on for three months or six months or 12 months in your business. So I hope that this was a really helpful exercise of simplifying the numbers behind $100,000. And again, a reminder, if you have not watched my video on why $100,000, why is that number important? Why does everybody talk about it? What's the big deal? Definitely make sure that you go check that out. Otherwise, if you are looking for a sales system that will work for you, you have to click the link below and download the uncensored sales system. It is a PDF that will walk you through exactly how to get clients from lead gen to close where this entire system will get you to hundred thousand dollars. Also, if you're looking for a support system on your way to hundred thousand dollars, make sure you join us in the ambitious women entrepreneurs, mastering sales skills community. And finally follow us over on Instagram at uncensored sales, and we'll see you in the next video.